Yo, it's me, Dead Carpet, and this is Dead Carpet Energy Drink Reviews, and it's 1.55 p.m., and it's Saturday, September 19th, 2020. Anyway, today I had to work some overtime at my work. I had to work for four hours, you know, but I'm um, anyway. Um, I got this energy drink that I'm going to be reviewing today. Um, I got it, um, I think two nights ago. Actually, it was, um, three nights ago, but I'm um, anyway, it was like the night I got paid, you know. I went to my local grocery store, Homeland. And um, I saw this there, and I was a little bit shocked to see this, but um, they had all three flavors that I've, well, the two flavors that I reviewed before, and then this flavor. So I don't know if they have other flavors of these or not, but um, anyway, yeah, today I'm going to be reviewing the new natural candy apple crisp bang energy drink. Oh yeah, boys. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Ah uh, yeah, anyway, it has a silver top with a silver tab. The bomb's the Best Buy Date and Production Code. Best by July 21st, 2021, so it's still fresh for a while. Around the top it says Nitro Jack, BCAs plus EAs, EA Aminos. Natural Bang, Bang Potent Brain and Body Fuel, Candy Apple Crisp, Natural Flavor, 16 fluid ounces, 1 pint, 473 milliliters, 0 calories per can. Bang Potent Brain and Body Fuel. Make no mistake, Natural Bang is not your stereotypical high sugar life sucking soda masquerading as an energy drink. High sugar drinks spike blood sugar, producing metabolic mayhem, causing you to crash harder than a test dummy into a brick wall. Powered with Natural Bang's Potent Body Rocking Fuel. Nitro Jack, Natural Caffeine and Natural EAAs. Essential Amino Acids, BCAAs, L Eleucine, L Isoleucine, L Valine, L Lysine, L Threonine, L Phenylanine, L Histidine. L Tritophan and L Methionine. Life's an extreme sport and bang is the extreme energy source to live life extreme. Not intended for individuals under the age of 18, main USA for domestic imported ingredients. Zero carbs, zero sugar, zero calories, zero artificial colors, zero sugar alcohol. Caution not, use as part of your pregnant or nursing, do not consume as part of your taking any prescription drug, nor have any medical condition. This part contains caffeine and should not be used with any other caffeine containing products. This part is intended for use by healthy individuals only. The consumer assumes all liability as far as using a manner not consistent with label guidelines. So yeah, copyright 2019, Vital Pharmaceuticals Incorporated, R.H. Reserved. To report a serious adverse event or obtain product information, contact 954-641-0570, extension number 3508. The address is 1600 North Park Drive, Weston, Florida, 33326, USA, info at vpxports.com, please recycle. At Bang Energy on Instagram, bang-energy.com. And Best by Date at bottom has the SKU, some other codes, and the Crown logo. Contains no fruit juice. Nutrition Fact Service has one can amount per serving calories, zero. Total fat, zero grams, zero percent. Saturated fat, zero grams, zero percent. Trans fat, zero grams. Cholesterol, zero milligrams, zero percent. Sodium, 70 milligrams, three percent. Total carbohydrate, zero grams, zero percent. Dietary fiber, zero grams, zero percent. Total sugar, zero grams, includes zero grams of added sugar, zero percent. Protein, zero grams. Vitamin D, zero micrograms, zero percent. Calcium, zero milligrams, zero percent. Iron, zero milligrams, zero percent. Potassium, six milligrams, zero percent. Vitamin C, 30 milligrams, 35 percent. Has other ingredients. It has stevia sweetener. Has the nitro jack, which is arugula extract. Natural caffeine from coffee beans, EAAs. And vitamin C, warning too much caffeine may cause nervousness, ir irritability. Sleeplessness and occasionally rapid heartbeat. Not recommended for use by individuals under 18 years of age. One serving of natural bang provides 250 milligrams of caffeine, which is more than two cups of coffee. Phenolate content in yours contains phenylalanine, so yeah. It has 250 milligrams of caffeine, so it will get you lit, boys, it will get you lit. It doesn't have as much caffeine as the normal bang, just 50 milligrams less, but still like really strong, you know, so don't need to drink in moderation. Probably shouldn't drink if you have anxiety problems and stuff, but yeah, you know what I mean? But yeah, I got it for an okay price. It's like right around $2 at my local grocery store, Homeland. So yeah, they also had the Natural Froze Rose and the Mango Bango. I already reviewed those two, but I found those at like random gas stations. And like each gas station that had them only had one flavor of each, you know. But um, now my local grocery store, Homeland, has all three flavors. Um, but um, anyway, I got this, so you know, and now I'm going to be reviewing it, so you know. But anyway, I'll let you see the can right quick. And today, after I got off work, I went to my Circle K gas station in town where I work. And I got the new Winter Edition Red Bull. So I'll be reviewing that in two reviews. And because my next review, I'm going to be reviewing the new Gold 3D Energy Drink. So you know, stay tuned for those reviews, you know. But um, I got lucky because um, the Winter Edition Red Bulls I got, 
They were about to get one free, but I got the last three cans. So, you know, I got lucky because of that, you know? So, you know, just saying. But, um, yeah. But, um, there's actually two other Circle Ks in the town where I work. Because my town where I work has three Circle Ks. So, they have a lot, you know? So, they probably have more in that town, you know? Just had to, like, find it, you know? But, yeah. Okay. Hopefully you can see this text and stuff okay. It's a little bit little and it's reflective. Okay. The warning and stuff. The distributor information. rest of the can, you know, and also, um, my local grocery store, Homeland, they had a lot of these, but they're all in, like, really, really bad condition, I got the best condition one, still, like, dented and stuff around the side, a little bit at the front, you know, like, right here and stuff, but, yeah, you know what I mean, it's the best condition one they had, though, so, you know, I got it, but, um, anyway, There's the other codes. Crown logo and the SKU. Okay, anyway, now it's the nutrition facts side. And the other ingredients. And the warning and stuff. Hopefully, you can see it okay. Okay, that's pretty much the whole can. But, um, yeah, anyway, I'm gonna shake it up, open it, taste it, and give my review for it, so hold on a minute. Okay, I went and got my brother just now while I had it paused, but, um, anyway, because he just got off work, you know, at McDonald's, but, um, anyway. Yeah, now I'm gonna shake it up, open it, taste it, and give my review for it, so, you know, hold on a minute. And, um, the original Candy Apple Crisp was in a green can with red at the top. This is white, but it has red at the top, but it has a green stripe around it. So, you know what I mean? But yeah, hopefully this is as good as the original one. Maybe it might be better. We shall see, though. But um, anyway, hold on. Okay, I'm not going to drink a lot of it. Because um, I had a Monster Ultra Rosa just like a few hours ago, you know. I don't want to get too bad anxiety and stuff, but you know what I mean? But yeah, I opened it. Didn't really um, explode or anything when I opened it. Looks pretty smooth and, like, not really carbonated. But yeah, the color is clear and artificial colors, so, you know. It's a little bubbly and stuff. Now it's starting to bubble a little bit, but um, not too much. But I'm um, anyway, the smell. Ooh. Whoa. 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 This one has an interesting scent. Like a way more interesting scent than the original one, that's for sure. Still smells like that same green apple type of scent, but um. It smells more like, um, a shampoo, though. It smells like one of the L'Oreal Kid shampoos I used to use when I was a little kid. Oh yeah, boys. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. It smells like a shampoo or like a soap or something. But like apple. It's a very citrusy type of scent. A little bit of a more syrupy type of scent. I don't know. It doesn't really smell artificial, but, um, it smells more, um, light, though. But, yeah, it smells very interesting, though. But, um, anyway, now I'm going to try it, so here goes. Well. 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 I actually really like the Mango Bango um, Natural Bang. And I like their um, Natural Frosé Rosé better than the real one, you know. But um, this one, though. No. 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 I definitely like the original one better than this one. That's for sure. A very, very, very light um, apple flavor. It's crisp. 
um, it's refreshing and smooth, but it's like really smooth, like not really carbonated at all. You can probably um, chug this can if you want to. You probably shouldn't though, because you know it has a lot of caffeine and stuff, but you know what I mean? You get hit all at once, you know? Um, but um, anyway, yeah, the flavor is like really, really like non, like barely noticeable, you know? It's like almost like you're drinking like water with like a hint of apple. That's what it is like flavor-wise. It's like um, you can barely tell it's apple. You can definitely taste the apple, but um, really watered down type of flavor. Like a really, really, like um, very light, very watered down type of apple flavor. Yeah, I like the original one way more than this one, that's for sure. It had a way stronger um, green apple flavor, very more, yeah, very more stronger and like pungent and stuff. This is like more of a light watered down flavor. And it does have a little bit of that, um, zero sugar, low calorie, like low calorie aftertaste, but, um, yeah, this one is like, um, not that good. It's like very weird, but it's interesting though. Yeah, more syrupy, watered down, very light apple flavored version of the original one. So, you know, um, if you like the original one, you probably won't like this one. Because, you know, I really like the original one. I gave it a 10 out of 10, you know. But on um, this one, though, no, no. I guess it is better for you a little bit because, you know, it's more natural. And it has less caffeine than the original one. But, um, yeah, the original one, I prefer that one way over this one, though. That's for sure. Really light, um, really, really light, non-noticeable type of flavor, you know. Really watered down type of flavor. Yeah, it's like not really that good. Um, the flavor you can still definitely tell it's an apple, but um, yeah, there's just something about it that makes it more watered down, I guess. Way more light tasting flavor, you know. Um, I prefer the more light um rose rose over the original one, but um, this one, I don't know, I don't like it as much as the original one, you know. I thought I would probably like this one better than the original one because I like the rose rose natural one better than the original one. But um, this one, no, no, no. But yeah, um, it has a cool can design though. I like the look of it. It's okay price is around $2 at my local grocery store. Um, energy wise, it works really strong, you know. It has 250 milligrams of caffeine. So yeah, boys, it will get you lit, you know. Um, drink in moderation, don't OD in it and stuff. And um, don't drink it if you have anxiety problems and stuff too. But yeah, energy wise, it lasts about five hours, about six hours of energy at the most. It may work more, it's really strong, you know. But flavor-wise, it's really light, barely noticeable, very watered down. Yeah, it's not really that good of a flavor, unfortunately, you know. Yeah, I gave the original one a 10 out of 10, but um, this natural candy ass apple, oh, I almost said candy, you know what I mean? You know what I almost said. But um, yeah, I'm going to give the natural candy apple crisp bang energy drink. I'm going to give it a... Well, energy-wise, it still works good. It has a cool can design. It has okay price, but I'm flavor-wise. No, so I'm going to give it an 8 out of 10. Oh, yeah, boys. Oh, yeah, it's still okay, but, um... Yeah, I definitely prefer the original one over this. I would still drink this, but, um... Probably won't buy it again, you know, just saying. Um, I do like apple-flavored energy drinks, you know. It's one of my favorite flavors, apple energy drinks are. But, um, this one, it's okay, but, um, you know... There's, like, way better apple drinks than this one. This one's, like, very light, very watered down. So, you know, definitely, um, I definitely prefer the original one over this one. But, yeah, I'm going to give it an 8 out of 10. Oh yeah, boys. Oh yeah, it's still okay. But, you know, could have been way better, you know, just saying. But, um, anyway, in my next review, I'm going to be reviewing the new gold Pina Colada 3D energy drink. Stay tuned for that review. Stay tuned for more videos. Stay tuned for more videos. Thanks for watching. See you guys later. Peace out. And bye.